So hello friends, welcome back to another new video. The Hall of Legends event will end in two weeks. And as I mentioned before, in the last week of the Hall of Legends event, we might see the Dynasties event. We'll discuss the Dynasties event a bit later, but for now, we're going to see new icons in the Hall of Legends event tomorrow. But we know that the event is already pretty much finished, with nothing much left to do within it. So they mentioned three new icons, but we already know who they are likely to be. All the base cards of the icons are already here, so the 100 rated CB will be Rio Ferdinand, CM will be Del Piero, and 101 rated CM will be Viera, and a few other cards are also on the way. And if you haven't claimed these packs yet, the only possible chance to get those cards for free is from here, because these packs will be updated with new players. Otherwise, there won't be any chances to get new cards from the event only from store packs and exchanges. But still, you'll need a lot of luck to get good cards, which I don't have at all. Anyways guys, in the last week of the Hall of Legends event, we might see some new exchanges. The chances are low, but there's still a slight possibility. Well, there's nothing new to say about the Icon Chronicle event for now. As for our predictions and thoughts, I've already shared them, guys. Basically, it's a very long-term event, so we can expect to see many new icons and amazing cards in the future. And I'll say it's worth completing the event because from every chapter, we get Mascarano as well as other amazing resources. So finishing the event is definitely worth it. And we've previously discussed this new chapter in the Heroes event as well. You don't have to reveal these clues. Just spend your clue tokens to type these ladders and the crossword will be easily solved. So if you haven't completed the chapter yet, you can easily do it now. And by solving the crossword, you'll get these rewards. So definitely, there are some amazing rewards, in my opinion, so try to complete it. Well guys, on August 15th, some interesting things are coming, mostly new packs and offers. But August 15th is India's Independence Day, so will we get anything related to India? Well, that's just my prediction, I don't know exactly what will come. And as you can see, the Dynasty's event will start on August 22nd, a mini star pass will be there as well. Since this will be a side event, it will basically be similar to the Sunshine Ballers event. It will be challenge mode based, and there will be some good packs available. And this is our concept for the Dynasty's event. Some brothers, fathers, and their son will be available. Also, we can expect some interesting players in this event. We might see the Bellingham brothers featured in the event. Nico Williams and his brother Inaki Williams could also be part of the event. Theo Hernandez and Lucas Hernandez could also be featured in the event. Zidane and Maldini, along with their sons, might also be included in the event. And guys, within the next two to three months, the FC Mobile 25 update will also be released. And recently, I made a detailed video about this. Please check it out, it includes some interesting concepts that I hope you'll find valuable or appealing, so do check out that video. Hazard, Beauty, Macon, Howard, and a few other new heroes are coming to FC Mobile 25, along with some brand new icons as well. They are already confirmed for the console version, and only male players will be featured in FC Mobile 25. It's pretty obvious. But let me know in the comments who you're most excited about. Well, that's all for today, guys. I hope you all like this video, and now enjoy this H2H match against our subscribers. And thank you so much for watching.